Hi, I'm Ranger Jim with Kerr Conti National Recreation Area, and I'm here at Blue Mesa Reservoir to tell you a little bit about the geology of the area. Some of our oldest rocks are found primarily below the water level of the reservoir, and they're Precambrian age, around 1.7 to 1.8 billion years, and they're some of the hardest rocks on Earth. They're metamorphic rocks. Above the lake level, we have a stack of sedimentary rock of Mesozoic age, uh, the lowest of which and the oldest of which is the Jurassic Morrison Formation. The Jurassic Morrison Formation is famous for containing a variety of fossils, including dinosaur fossils, uh, which we have found here at Kerr Conti National Recreation Area. The fossils that we have found here at Kerr Conti include Allosaurus, Apatosaurus, Camarasaurus, Ceratosaurus, the Diplodocus or Barosaurus, we're not sure which the fossil specimen was, uh, and the Colorado State fossil Stegosaurus. Above the Morrison Formation and younger in age, we find the Dakota Sandstone, which forms the cliff face behind me. In that formation, we have found uh, fossilized remains of wood and plant matter. The youngest sedimentary unit that we find in this area is the Mancos Shale, which forms a yellow and gray uh, layer above the rest of that sedimentary stack. It was deposited when Colorado was covered by an ancient ocean, and in that layer we do find fossilized fish remains. The youngest rocks that we find in our region are of volcanic origin. They formed when some of the largest volcanoes to have ever existed erupted. The West Elk volcano was to our north and the San Juan volcano was to our south. When those volcanoes erupted, they deposited the West Elk breccia, which forms the famous Dillon Pinnacle columns, and the San Juan Tuff, which forms a cap rock above those columns. Since the time that these volcanic rocks have been deposited, Erosional processes have been undercutting the softer West Elk breccia below, while the San Juan Tuft remains on top as a harder cap rock. The processes and the different hardnesses of those rocks have formed those column shapes of the Dillon Pinnacles. Have a great time exploring the geological formations, the rocks and the fossils here at Curacanti, but be sure to leave everything that you find exactly where you found it. And if you do find a fossil, be sure to tell a park ranger so they can follow up.